sources claim that Amy Robach received a bigger settlement when she left ABC News than TJ. Holmes. Insiders told Page Six that the two both earned a large severance package from the television network, but that Robach received an even higher settlement than Holmes, although another insider informed the website that the settlement's specifics remain a tightly guarded secret. They added that Amy has been at ABC for a lot longer and has a far bigger deal. Before Holmes began working there in 2014, Robach, who co-hosted GMA3 and appeared on 20 Over 20, joined the organization in 2012. The couple, whose relationship was first exposed in November, just was paid what they would have been owed for the remainder of their relationship, according to a second source. They said, it's possible they could have gotten paid a little bit more to sign an NDA, and to preserve the peace, though. After spending some time in Los Angeles, the anchors are now reportedly back in New York, sitting low and are happy with their pay. A representative from ABC News has been contacted by Et Canada for comment. The source's remarks follow ABC News confirmation to Et Canada that the couple was departing after weeks of relationship-related talk. We all agreed that it's best for everyone if Amy Robach and TJ Holmes leave ABC News after having several fruitful discussions with them about various choices. We appreciate their efforts and are grateful for their ability and dedication over the years, said a spokeswoman. The couple had been taken off the air while executives looked into their relationship. After 12 years of marriage, it was made public in December that Holmes had requested a divorce from his wife Marilee Feebig. They got married in 2010 and have a kid together named Sabine. From his first marriage to Amy Furson, Holmes is also the father of Brianna and Jaden. Contrarily, Robach married Andrew Shue in 2010, and the two are said to have broken up last year.